We root for you guys yeah, when yeah, you're not yeah. playing us. Absolutely. <laughs> that's why I tell you good luck every week. And, that's you know right, I mean, man. that's because, you know, you, that's just, you know, we want to we want to be better than you guys, but that's, you know, we want you to be better than everybody else. That's, <laughs> that's right. The Blitz. High school football from the field to your screen. Sponsored by Moxie Credit Union and KW Recovery Lab. Okay, this question, what do you remember uh, from my days as a football player? You know what I remember most about w with you personally was us deciding what college you go to. Yeah. And, uh, and I remember you coming in and saying, hey, uh, and I remember the coaches, how they would do, you know, how they would always patch you to see how heavy you were because you never were real heavy, you know what I mean? No, yeah, yeah. And I remember that part of it. And I remember you were going to go to uh, Hawaii to take a trip to mm -hmm. Hawaii. And I kept trying to convince you that your coach needed to go with you. <laughs> we were going to do it. And we had it set up. We, did. It, we had it, it set up. It didn't work out. There was something wrong with it, but it didn't work out. The, so. I think that coaching staff got removed right before we did yeah, the Yeah, and that's what happened. Like so that. Kind of like plans changed. You're like, well, when I land somewhere, I'll let you know. And so you end up going to SAC, right? Yeah, yeah. Instead. So yeah. SAC was the only yeah. offer then at that point. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. Well, so. and then your tenacity. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> you got after people. Yep. Yeah, and that's what uh, that's that's the fun part of it. That kind of stuff. That was that was a lot of the fun part about playing football to me was yeah. that yeah. just being physical. And yeah. Just just going all out. Yeah. yeah. Just let it turn it loose. Turn it loose, turn it loose. man. Yeah. Snap to whistle. Yeah, Maybe a little, a little bit past. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, it's a, well, it's a fine line. <laughs> what memories do you have of me as uh, as your coach? I remember just one time, just vividly, like I was a junior probably that year, um, on a pretty good uh, senior heavy, as far as the linemen went that year, like Robert Sanchez, yeah, those was guys, guys like that. And, that was a good team. Yeah. And uh, <clears throat> I just remember like we ran this drill, we you call it West Point. It was like, I think it was two offensive linemen, a deep D lineman, maybe was it a two on one or three on one drill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You remember this? Yeah. Well, we I remember this one time, I split double team and just stuck the back. And you went crazy. And this is his practice. Yeah. And all the other guys, I remember them looking at me, and I was like, ha ha, like, yeah, yeah. Laugh, I was like, <laughs> like laughing at them. I said, see, boy, that's how you do it. And I just, I, I never forgot that. You know, yeah. I think that's what helped. That you showing that enthusiasm to me. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I fed off that. I was like, yeah, and that's uh, really yeah, hyped. And, I think it's important to to make a big deal out when people do things right. That's always show know, a little emotion, man. Show, well, yeah. emotion's what the game's all about. Yeah. yeah. Christopher James, when did you first consider becoming a coach and why? I remember when I when I first got back from Sacramento, you probably caught word from them yeah. or from somebody, but uh, yeah, he got the word to me. I remember I was driving a tractor, you know, I was just home helping my dad on a weekend, and they kept come over and kept bugging me. Uh, I remember finally, like probably the third time, I called you back. Yeah. I said, All right, I'll call you back. <laughs> so I, it was actually you, coach. You yeah. Know, you're the reason I'm a coach today. Oh, that's, that humbles me. That humbles yeah. Me. That's, yeah. I can remember. Uh, uh, well, actually, after I think we played Lincoln in the playoffs, and I think we won, we won a playoff game, yep. and uh, I, I, your mom had come to see them, mm -hmm. and uh, she, I asked her how, how, how it was going, and you decided to, to come home and finish up a snatch loss, and I can remember saying, hey, well, he needs to come out and help us out and stuff, <laughs> yeah. and I remember it did take a little while to get you out there, yeah, it was but we did it. Persistence yeah. paid off, because you knew as soon as I got hooked, I was in. <laughs> yeah, you got that right. Yeah, I got that I haven't right. stopped since, so thank you. What's been your most memorable moment of the season so far? There's been a lot. I'd say probably last night. <laughs> you yeah. know, that was wild. I've never good. never had to leave a football game in my in my life. Yeah, I don't yeah. think. Yeah. And um, my wife calls me and says, or texts me and said, "Don't panic." <laughs> but I'm at the <laughs> hospital. You know, we're like eight months pregnant right yeah, now, yeah. and so I was like, I had to figure out. Okay, it's half. T I didn't get the message till halftime. I figure trying to figure out. How can I get there? You know, it's yeah. just up in the Modesto at Kaiser. How am I going to? That's a drive. That's yep. going to take you 30 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, you know, you just do it. Yeah. I got out there after halftime, watched the kids start the second half. Yeah. And I go, you know what? I told the coach staff, you guys got this. And obviously they rallied. They did, yeah, man. They I was rallied. Yeah, you know what? I'm happy to see that. Yeah, they'll, they'll do that. I, uh, for me, for me, it's, uh, you know, uh, I wouldn't say one great, a bunch of small ones. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? And uh, uh, it's been an interesting year. It's because my, my son's on the team, it's his senior year and stuff, and that's that's always, uh, there's been a lot of stuff with that, you know, that, that I, I won't forget. And, uh, you know, coming back last night after being down 10 at the end of the third quarter, that was, kids really showed showed a lot of heart, and, and uh, we had to move some people around, and uh, some good things happened, you know. Yeah. So that's probably my best, it's on the top of my mind right now, you know. Yeah. What would your team name be if you were in a fancy football league? <laughs> I would do that, so I don't, I don't really know without, you know. 
I might say something bad. So <laughs> <laughs> I've never done fantasy football either. Nah, I've never been in a league. Well, I just never. I, who's got the time this time yeah. of year? I mean, you know, mm -hmm. I know some of our some of our guys do and stuff, but uh, my I know my my brother does it and his friends, but. Uh, I've never, and I don't really look at football that way. Yeah. You know what I mean? I oh, think, I know. That changes the way you look at it. For me, it wouldn't be anything. Fun, yeah. So. I feel the same way. That's yeah. interesting. For both, do you have a special pregame meal? <laughs> You're like me, I can't eat. <laughs> I'll eat a protein bar as all my stomach can handle before a game, and then. Yeah. So. I usually just try to pack a big lunch like yeah. on that day yeah. because I know I'll get hungry at some point and I'll, yeah. I'll eat, but I never know what it's going to be. Yeah. could be at 9 a.m., you know, yeah. right after I just ate breakfast. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. They just, you just don't know, right? <laughs> so many times that lunch doesn't make it quite till noon. You know, you know we get we get a lot of our coaches, you know, we go travel and they'll, they'll travel separately because I'm always the one that's got to do the bus. So, but Exactly. But they go and, yeah, we went and ate here. I was like, oh, how do you do that? I can't do that. And they all can. I'm the only one that can't. They make fun of me before games. I, I feel the same way, man. Yeah, I post can't. pictures like when we're on the road. Oh, yeah. we stopped here and ate. It, it was great. Like good for and you. Pictures of all the guys hanging <laughs> yeah, out. Yeah, everybody's hanging out, having and, a good time, and relaxing. And, and you're on, on the bus, bus. chewing my fingernails. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> on the yellow school bus heading down the freeway. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Thanks, guys. Yeah. <laughs> all right. What is your favorite oh, part of the Harvest Bowl week? I, I like, like the crowd. Honestly, yeah. oh yeah, the buzz is. The I buzz think is that's big. cool. Yeah, you know, there's no game like that in the Central Valley. I don't. I no, don't no, mean. and it's really hard. The hardest thing about that game, especially when when both teams are good, because you're gonna play get a playoff game the following week, and it will be about a third as many people there, yeah. and the buzz will be a third. You know what I mean? Yeah. And so, it, there's a good buzz. I agree with you mm -hmm. on that. It's 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 uh, as long as it's a uh, as long as it's. Uh, Civil. Yeah, done you know in a I mean? positive light. Yeah, yep. yeah, and I think it needs to be civil, and that's what mm -hmm. it's, and it's not always civil, and it's not, I wouldn't say it has much to do with the two teams and coaches. I think it has to do with the people outside, but, you know, it'd be a lot more fun maybe sometimes just to go play someplace when nobody's watching. <laughs> yeah, hey, sorry, we, we yeah. played the game we Thursday. We played the game we Thursday when no one was watching. You guys so. can all watch it, though. Yeah. Yeah. But the community enjoys it, you know, yeah. and I don't I don't mean it in any, in any negative way. It's just, uh, yeah. it's just uh, there's so much that comes with it that it makes it kind of, yeah, I mean, I wouldn't mind playing the game week f six or something. You know, I just because uh, you're still going to get the crowd, but it just at the end of the year it just makes it a certain way. It's yeah, yeah. especially years like this. Man. Yeah, it seems yeah. like we keep bumping yeah, into yeah. each other like yeah. this. Yeah, you know, well, it's high stakes game. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. And it makes and it, a, it already. A there's big already game. there's already mm -hmm. a lot of pressure on it anyway. But then the community stuff is it can make it. Uh, Make it tough too. I don't think they get that at Central Catholic. I don't, I don't think, think they, they get, get that, that at, at people St. Mary's. I don't. No, people don't get it. No, no, they don't get it. I remember the very first year and watching the superintendent flop sides at halftime. It's like it's hilarious. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like I'm not partial to anybody, and we're going back. It's like uh, almost like a yeah. it's a parade or something. I don't know. You know what I mean? It's yeah. Just, it just you don't think of those things. You don't think of it like yeah. that. But yeah. I can see you know the like yeah. The, the There's phone a reason for it. Get. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure the, even the journal probably gets phone calls oh, from yeah. parents saying, yeah, yeah. "Hey, how come you're covering uh, yeah. Pittman so much? Yeah. And why is the bulldog yeah. on the left?" And uh, yeah, the you got the Pittman the right. parents calling saying, "Hey, why are you always <laughs> repping the bulldogs, man? Get us some love." Yeah, everybody, seeing the whole community is involved in that kind. It's of cool. Thing, so. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what are your memories of the first Harvest Bowl? Well, the first one I remember, the what I remember the most is, <clears throat> is Pittman. Well, I was at Turlock then, and Pittman fumbling the snap. And uh, the ball's laying on the ground, and we had the play snuffed, but the quarterback picked it up and fell for a first down on fourth down. Yeah. And it was just, you know, and I remember Kaepernick rolling out and being right on the sideline and throwing a ball deep and, uh, mm -hmm. and then making the catch. And both those things uh, were the difference in the game. That's what yeah. I remember the most. I was things. coaching the D-line for Turlock back then. I yeah, remember yeah, thinking, yeah. like, oh, this is a quarterback we can get to. You know, yeah, I'm yeah, thinking yeah. this guy is not as, as – Good as people think he is, and that we can we can get to him, and we just did not have a guy fast enough to catch him. Honestly. No, he had a way of slipping. That yeah. stuff. And the thing is, is the, at that at that time they didn't use his feet very much because no. they they wanted to keep him healthy, and mm -hmm. uh, he ended up being one of the best running quarterbacks of all time. I know that's <laughs> insane. How good he got. And I, yeah, and, I, and filled know, out too. Yeah, yeah, and he that was the big bigger. thing is he was he was so thin going in. Mm -hmm. You know, I think that uh, that's why he's uh, became much more of a, a runner later because he became such a physical specimen later. Yeah, you know. So. And then they also, you also had the Fresno State, you know, the running back Anthony Hardy. Yeah, yeah, that didn't, that didn't yeah. hurt. Yeah, <laughs> so the, you had to defend that. You want to take care of yeah. Cap? Okay, we yeah, got you this can't, guy Yeah, too. that's always tough so. when there's multiple weapons on the field. Oh yeah, that that, they had a good, team. good team that first Harvest Bowl. For both, based on what you've seen on film, how would you describe my team? 
I'll go first. Okay. I think your team's physical. I think it's fast. I think you've got a lot of really good athletes. You know what I mean? Yep. I think your quarterbacks, your quarterbacks is is dynamic. I think your tight end does a great job. You know, I'm sure he's a great teammate too, because I know that guy. He's he's a good kid. Yeah. Um, and he's one of the few kids I know on your team. But uh, I think there's a lot of. Uh, obviously, you guys have size. You're physical. You know, that's that's what I see. I I don't um, know a lot of your players. You know, uh, just you know, I just just don't. But yeah. I I know from watching them on film, they are well well coached. I think you have probably one of the top defenses in the league that mm -hmm. I've seen on film. Um, your offense is always on point. You know, every time we play, we know we're going to get a physical uh, front, and we have we have to be prepared for that. And you guys are quick to the ball and can snap the ball fast and move the ball in multiple directions. You guys have a receiver this year, year that's really scary. Um, you know, top some of the top running backs in our league, and I think you know they'll do well in our section too. And, so those are all things I think about when we play you guys. I know we're gonna have to be sound. Yeah. We cannot make mistakes. Question for both. Prediction <laughs> for the Harvest Bowl 15. Wow. What's your prediction, James? We, uh, I don't know. Turlock wins by by a, a point. A point? Because <laughs> <laughs> I heard if, if you score more points than the other team. Yeah, that's you, a good, it's a good deal <laughs> when things no. like that happen. No, I really, uh, I think, my prediction, I just I think we're gonna see a lot of great sportsmanship, a yeah. lot of hard nosed football yeah. and that that's really what, what I'm looking forward to is it's our gonna, it's gonna be loud game. and it's gonna be crazy. Yep. There's gonna be people that get upset about certain things. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You gotta you gotta yeah. know that. Something's gonna happen. <laughs> something weird's gonna, gonna happen. Yeah, it's always gonna be yeah. something weird. But uh the thing is is that <clears throat> it's just it's just a football game. And uh prediction wise it's just gonna it'll be fun. Yeah. We'll have fun. That's that's what I think too. We'll shake hands after the game. Yeah, that's for sure. Yeah, <laughs> might shake it harder than, <laughs> than if we just run each other on the street. But yeah, no doubt.